California Highway Police said today tests show the woman who drove her family off a cliff last month was legally drunk. Jamie Ucas has more on this late development. Jennifer Hart was behind the wheel and drunk when she plunged her family's SUV over a 100-foot cliff. Jennifer Hart's blood alcohol level was above the legal limit. Her wife, Sarah Hart, and six children were inside the vehicle. Investigators say it was crashed intentionally. Sarah Hart had a significant amount of the ingredient, primarily in Benadryl, in her system. Two of the children also were determined to have had Benadryl-type of substances. Benadryl is an allergy medicine that can make people feel sleepy. The hearts and three of their children were found dead last month. The Oregon women had adopted all six children, including Devante, who you may remember from this 2014 picture, hugging a Portland police officer during a protest against the Ferguson police shooting. Child Protective Services had recently visited their home after the children complained about being abused to neighbors. In 2011, Sarah pled guilty in Minnesota to domestic assault after a teacher saw bruises on one of the children. Three children are still missing. Investigators say they recently found a body near where the vehicle went into the ocean, but Jeff, they have not been able to positively identify it yet as one of the children. Tragic case, Jamie Ucas, thank you.